Okay, so we're getting ready to put on the main color of the lathe. It's going to be a light gray. It's base coat, just like the red and the black, so we could put a bunch of colors on at once and then clear them all at the same time to make them shiny and protect them. So we're going to mix this with base coat hardener and base coat reducer. Mixes four to one to one with one of these handy dandy mixing cups. Okay, put on the first coat of clear. Okay, that's the finished product right there. It's all uh, it's all cleared over. The clear coat's dry, and the thing runs great. And uh, there's the tailstock. It's all finished up. The banjo tool rest. And um, here I'll show you the inside of this cabinet here. 
just the motor and we didn't we didn't do too much to refinish any of this stuff in here the pulleys are because it doesn't really show so we just cleaned it up pretty much we did paint the inside of this cabinet the bearings are all sealed just the can't speed control put this back Um, everything's all wired back together a little bit tricky putting everything back together, but it runs so I'm gonna turn this on now Put that down at a really slow speed I'll turn it up a little bit Seven hundred, eight hundred RPMs. And that thing could haul a lot faster. I stopped at one thousand, it could go all the way to three thirty two hundred there. I don't know when I'd ever put it that quick because that's kind of a death wish there, but other than that, the whole thing is great. All set up nice. There's my old lathe right there. I just look at it. <laughs> oh, this thing looks so bad compared to that now. But, um, hope I'll be able to get some better projects for you guys every Friday. And, uh, I'll put some uh, pictures up at the end of this. And, um, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Comment with any ideas. And subscribe to my channel for new woodworking videos every Friday. Thanks for watching.